We're Howard and Caitlin Newstate of the Newstate Nomads. In 2020, we camped for free for 125 straight days, and it's still our favorite camping method of choice. So today, we're going to be sharing five of our favorite free campsites across the western United States. And make sure you stick around to the very end to see our all-time favorite free campsite. First up, we're heading to Montana, just outside of Glacier National Park. With limited campsites inside the park and the popularity of commercial campgrounds nearby, we were thrilled to find an excellent free campsite just minutes away located in Flathead National Forest. This beautiful camping area along Middle Fork Flathead River is also known as Blankenship Bridge Dispersed Camping. We decided to kind of scout out what else was available and we got a primo spot, guys. Wait till you see this. It is important to note that unlike like most national forest land that offers up to 14 days of free camping, Blankenship Bridge has a limit of just three days. If you're in a larger or longer rig, you'll definitely want to scout out the road conditions leading down towards the riverbed. If it's recently rained, there can be large puddles and the road is a bit rough. We saw RVs of all shapes and sizes while we were there and had no problems getting into the site in our 25-foot Class C motorhome. But with all boondocking locations, you'll want to make sure that you can get there safely and pay attention to weather conditions during your stay. We always recommend reading other campers' reviews on Campendium ahead of time, too. It's a great resource for finding and learning about different locations and seeing how others rate things like ease of access, site quality, noise level, and more. If connectivity is important for you, you can even see how other RVers rate their cell coverage for a particular location and cell carrier. This has been a vital feature for us when working from the road. Blankenship Bridge is a great spot to set up camp for a few days if you're planning to explore nearby Glacier National Park. It's less than a 15 minute drive to the park entrance and only about 20 minutes from the town of Columbia Falls, which has great dining options. We're heading south to Arizona for our next campsite. Welcome to Coconino National Forest near Flagstaff. This is a great place to escape the summer heat or enjoy cooler temperatures in the fall because of its higher elevation. We're at 7,100 feet here, so it's really great to finally get to sit and relax and hopefully we won't hear much of anything. There are several forest service roads with tons of camping options here. There is a 14 day stay limit and it's first come first serve. We camped in two different areas and loved the wooded and spacious sites. There are even a few hiking trails throughout the National Forest, which was great to take the pups out for evening exploration. In our opinion, this free campsite is all about location. It's about a 20 minute drive into Flagstaff, 45 minutes north to Sunset Crater Volcano National Monument, and about 40 minutes south into Sedona. So it's a great jumping off point for exploring all that this area of Arizona has to offer. Next up, we're heading to an RVer's dreamland, Utah. There are incredible places to camp all throughout this beautiful state, but we're focusing our attention on BLM land just south of Moab. BLM stands for Bureau of Land Management, and these are typically large areas of federal land that we can camp on for up to 14 days at a time. We stayed at the Black Ridge Dispersed Camping Area off of Yellow Circle Road and chose this spot because we could explore Moab and both Arches and Canyonlands National Parks, including the lesser visited Needle section of Canyonlands. This free campsite can accommodate rigs of all sizes. The lower sections are easily accessible off the main road, and if you're feeling adventurous, you can scout out more private sites up the hill. And the best part? These beautiful views won't cost you a dollar. Our fourth free campsite can be found in beautiful Santa Fe, New Mexico. There's this huge national forest only about 15 minutes outside of downtown Santa Fe. So it's perfect for setting up camp and exploring. The dirt road leading into the camping area is smooth and there are plenty of flat level areas to choose from here for all size RVs. The lack of tall trees in the area is great if you have solar on your roof and the views are pretty nice too. But it's really all about the proximity to town. You're only 15 minutes from downtown Santa Fe, making this an ideal location for exploring this cultural mecca. From amazing food to fascinating history and even a bit of indulgence, Santa Fe really has it all and knowing that your home on wheels is a 15 minute drive away is really icing on the cake. 
Drum roll please, our fifth free campsite also happens to be our new favorite camping area. Welcome to beautiful Creed, Colorado. Just two miles outside of town, you'll find a few forest service roads with plenty of campsites to choose from. For larger rigs, you can set up camp right off the main road. Many sites have established rock fire rings and all of them have absolutely incredible views. I'm so excited because we get even more views of the epic rocks, which are my favorite part of this campsite. The mountains and like the valley and everything is gorgeous, but those rock formations are just so unique. And I feel like that's part of why I wanted to come to Creed in the first place, because there's this iconic photo looking down Main Street, Creed, and you can see those rock formations. This spot quickly rose to the top of our list because of the stunning scenery, how close it is to town, and the amount of things to do in the area. A city provided dump station and fresh water fill can be found found right in town, and there are so many great dining and shopping options too. Plus, you'll want to explore all the natural beauty Creed has to offer with a drive along the Bachelor Loop Trail, where you can see the remnants of old mines. That, that is our campsite. That is literally our campsite. And then just head back to your campsite to relax and enjoy these magnificent Colorado views.